What's good, fam? It's your boy back in the lab, getting ready to cook up another video. You rocking with me? Gonna get this video a thumbs up, like, comment, share, subscribe. Or with all that being said, man, y'all see the title: BLM activists pulled up on Charleston White for disrespecting Black Lives Matter. Now nah, I'm gonna just go to the next slide for y'all, man. I'm trying to get y'all thoughts on this. He said, "He said, fuck Black Lives Matter. We just trying to make sure they get some in the clear." He said, "What?" He said, "Fuck Black Lives Matter. It's freedom of press, though." Now you see Charles Dwight on his phone. He 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 on the phone with the police right now, or his FBI buddies, as he like to call them. He said what he said, man. He said fuck you and Black Lives Matter. Y'all just heard him, man. So he's standing on what he's saying. And, um, me personally, I think this protest is full of BS. Cause personally, if that's if you really was on that timing and coming in, you wouldn't be clout chasing with a camera, none of that. You would have. You would have did Charles Snow White how certain people want to do him. Um, I'm going to continue to let this video play for y'all. You! You just trying to see. Just trying to get an interview. He said, he said, fuck Black Lives Matter. We're just trying to make sure they get some in the clear. You said, what? You said, fuck Black Lives Matter. It's freedom of press, though. So y'all let me know y'all thoughts on that man. Y'all heard Charles on White, man. He 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 just threw shots back at him. Um y'all heard somebody say, well put the camera down, man. Uh it could have got ugly though. It could have ended up like recent situations we've seen in the past. I don't want to say no names, but y'all know who I'm talking about, man. He was sitting in a restaurant, and I'm sure Charleston White had his pole on him. He, that's a dude who don't go nowhere with his pole. He lived in the South. Uh, he allowed to carry. He don't play. Let me go to the next topic for y'all. Uh, ABC Studios are releasing a documentary about Young Thug and Gunner, which features many rappers. Let me go to this. Two of the hottest rappers coming out of Atlanta now in big legal trouble. What is this? This is outrage. Young Thug and Gunna charged in a sweeping 56 count indictment. Authorities say they believe the two are associated with the Atlanta based YSL gang. Prosecutors are using rap music lyrics to build their cases against hip hop artists. That was gasoline on a small fire and turning it into something major. Their music is being used against them. I just kind of was like, I want to know. <clears throat> Do ABC know something we don't know already? Um, why is they filming this documentary already? It's just it's like a money grab, if you ask me. Y'all let me know y'all thoughts, so man. What? These guys are superstars. Number one album, first week, the gun. And then I realize rap is back on trial. What is happening? There's lots of us locked up in prison. No one should have their artistic expression come back to hunt them at a trial in a criminal case. Okay, so this is a good documentary about them on ABC. I guess they're doing the right thing. They, they basically saying you shouldn't have your lyrics used against you during the trial. Um, and I agree with ABC. And that's what many people have been saying for the longest. You shouldn't have your lyrics used against you. But they recently have been changing all these laws and shit. I think it's BS. Let me continue to let this video play, man. Hip-hop is judged unlike any other genre. Like, black people are judged unlike any other people. You decide to admit your crimes over a beat, I'm going to use it. Two of the hottest rappers coming out of Atlanta now in... Y'all heard the Atlanta DA, man. She said, if you decide to use crime on lyrics on beats, I'm going to use it. Um, she not playing, man. She she trying to crack down and clean the streets. I just wanted to play that for y'all, though, man. Y'all let me know y'all thoughts on this whole little situation and about the Charles White situation. It's your boy. I'm out.